Okay, Lauren, I'm just going to make you a video to explain this comment that I'm about to make here because I think it'll be easier if um, I just explain it. So what I'm talking about is that these stories that you've chosen for first graders to read are just too difficult. So if I grade level wise, so if I click on Rapunzel, you'll see there are just a lot of words and first graders, especially reading online, they're going to get lost because they're they're just not at the grade level that this reading passage is. So what I've suggested is that you go ahead and um, help them uh, or teach them how to use a uh, text to speak um, Chrome extension. If you see right here, I have speak it without a there's no space in between them. So if you go to the Chrome Web Store, just do a Google search Chrome Web Store. And then when you get there, do a search for speak it extension. And what it does is that any website that you're on, you can highlight any part of it, do a right click. And then if you click right here, speak. There were once a man and a woman who had long in vain wished for a child. At length, the woman hoped that God was about to grant her desire. And that's all it'll read to you. It'll only read what you have highlighted. And so kids, you could teach students how to do this as well so they could do it. And so they would have access to any um, text that is online and then they could have it speak to them. So then they could do what you're asking with the rest of your hyperdoc, because if they can't read it, then they won't be able to, to do what you're asking them to do with the content. So um, that's just my explanation, my uh, comment.